Shalom, Shalom. Giving all glory on and praises to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Bahakwadash, Yahweh is the name of the Heavenly Father, which means He is, He exists. By Zen Haiz Dasham, His name of His own begotten Son, Yahweh Shai, which means He says He delivers. Double honors to the apostles, elders, a great millstone who rule us. Shalom, Makasala, Bakiyar. Peace and mercy to the elect. <clears throat> It'll be a quick, quick lesson. Uh, yeah, I was watching the uh, Apostle of Rub Law earlier before the camp. Uh, he did a lesson entitled E Destroys Everything. You know, E Destroys Everything. And when he's, you know, we already know who E is. He's the, the Edomites, Esau, Edom, right? Which the scriptures speak about this devil, right? In John, the 10th chapter, but in particular, the Lord Yahweh was rebuking wicked strides of Pharisees, man, in that verse in particular, man, right? Because that's who Yahweh Shah was going back and forth with when he was on the scene 2,000 years ago. He was been going back and forth against Israelites, right? The Sanhedrin, the sitting together, the council, right? These Israelites who, you know, uh, the Jews of the circumcision, right? The wicked strides of Pharisees. But we also use that scripture for Esau, Edom. John 10 and 10, the thief, because we know Esau is a thief. He stole our identity. He stole our heritage, man. He stole the precious jewels of the Heavenly Father, right? Which he, he is a thief, right? That's why when you read Job, the 30th chapter, when the Heavenly Father is referring to these Edomites, uh, he said, he, he referred to them as the basis of men, right? And he says in that chapter that they cried after them as after a thief. <clears throat> That's why these other nations want to uh, push you Edomites out of their land because you steal all their resources, right? You steal all their resources. That's all you do is you bleed them dry. Okay? So, yeah, the Apostle Rumlov, he did this lesson. He destroys everything. He destroyed the food. He destroyed the air. He destroyed the water. Put fluoride in your water, man. Put. I seen a video. They was talking, some scientists were talking about how the stuff that they eat like the dealing with the pizzas, talk about niggas that eat anything covered with pizza. And Apostle Romla was mentioning how Jake, how Esau study and Jake don't, man. You know, but this devil destroyed, the, he, he destroyed life itself, right? He destroyed men, right? You got men want to be women, right? You got men want to have uh, body modifications, get breast implant, fucking BBLs, men doing this shit too. So this man destroyed the hearts of the mind, in particular, you eat it, you Israelites, but also just people in general, man. Anybody that's um, anybody that's an advocate, or anybody that's um, <clears throat> Shalaki. You. you know. But like I said, you know, uh, he destroyed the hearts of the mind of the people. He destroyed food, right? He just destroyed everything, man. He destroyed the soil. Okay, he destroyed the animals. He fucking into uh, bestiality where they land down and having sexual relations with animals. He destroyed. He destroyed the ecosystem, right? That's why it's February. It, it, you know, February 9th, I, What is it? The ninth or the tenth? One of these days or the eleventh? Right, uh, 2023, the hopeful year that all the prophecies come to pass, man. And it's February, and the brothers are speaking about how when they was young, I'm not from originally from Ohio, but that's where I live at now. <laughs> they was talking about back in the days in February, you have hella snow, and now it's a sunny day. As you can see, the sun, right? If I lift the thing up, the sun, right? Um, no snow, no not a cloud in the sky. So this devil destroyed the ecosystem. He destroyed the weather. That's why he got something known as global warming, man. Right? And it's a consequence and repercussions for doing such things pursuant to the scriptures. So you got to be destroyed pursuant to the scripture. Revelation 11, 18. And the natures were angry. Right? Because he destroyed people's way of life. That's another thing he did. Because... You know, hundreds of years ago, you had, I, I wouldn't even date, dare say thousands of years ago, you had something on, well, well, yeah, it was hundreds of years ago, it was the last monarchy, 
with you going to uh, Kaiser Wilhelm III, if I'm not mistaken, with that situation, that conflict, the confrontation between uh, them. And then the result was the rival republic. They destroyed the money, right? They destroyed their they, their, their uh, currency. I forget that I ain't been over it in a minute, Salaki. Right, but like I said, he destroys people's <clears throat> way of life, right? And, and these nations, they angry at that. Right, he destroyed the relations, the family relationship, man. He destroyed the relationship between the man and the woman, right? Because he got women thinking that they men, right? And men thinking that if you ain't pleasing your wife, that there's something wrong. Why you got to say happy wife, happy life? That's all a part of the, the, the destruction tactic, the destructive tactics of this devil, man, right? He destroyed everything. He destroyed the air. He got cars, motherfucker. So many cars in America, if I'm not mistaken, you got more cars than people in the United States, bro. You know, because you have, you know, a lot of households, they got multiple cars, bro. Right? Um, <clears throat> so, yeah, like I said, he destroyed the food, the water. He even destroyed medicine, right? Because the scripture talk about let thy herbs be thy medicine. I, I let thy food be thy medicine. So, you ain't supposed to get fucking... Uh, a fucking uh, 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 a FLU shot. You ain't supposed to get a Crown Royal One Nine shot, right? You ain't supposed to get uh, what's that shit called? Immunizations, yo, yo, your children fucking for school, right? <clears throat> so he destroyed medicine, which is the food. He destroyed the food, the soil, no selenium in it. It can't produce how it's supposed to produce. All right. <laughs> and like I said, it's consequences and repercussions for that. So the Heavenly Father about to come back because that's what he's coming back to do, to destroy. Right? Think not that I come to send peace on earth. Well, I mean, I'll say this. The Lord is coming to destroy and to deliver. Right? That's the duality of Yahweh Ba Shimei I was shot. Well, he's coming back to destroy these Edomites, man. And two-thirds of his own people who don't want to those mine enemies that I should not reign over them, bring them here and slay them before me. So uh, the two-thirds of our people who don't want to be under the subjection and the authority and the preeminence of Yahweh Shai, Yahweh Ba Shai, Shai, you gotta get destroyed. You, 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 hey man, you are uh, assisting E in the destruction of the society and the destruction of the world, man. Right? He destroyed religion, right? Because Apostle Gabor, he goes into that about how the Heavenly Father gave us religion, right? Which was the Lost Touch of Command. So he destroyed that <clears throat> with, with, his, with his religion, man. With his philosophy and his ideology, right? So um, there's got to be a reconstruction. So that's the period that we're in right now. The Heavenly Father is reconstructing and, and building back up the house of David that is fallen pursuant to uh, Amos, the ninth chapter, close up the breaches thereof, right? It rebuild it in the days of old. So it's a reconstruction process, a rebuilding process because this devil destroyed everything, man, right? And what's the vehicle and the main tool that the Heavenly Father is using to reconstruct and, and, and rebuild the hearts and the minds of the people to rebuild, you know, this word, this wisdom, understanding, knowledge, man, you know, so, like I said, this was just a quick, quick lamb back that Apostle, Ricard, I meant Salaki, Apostle Romlob, he did a lesson, and it was a beautiful lesson, he was going into a song that Jake made in 1984, that was basically highlighting this devil, you know what I'm saying, indirectly, okay, so, this was a quick lesson, man. I pray this will edify. I want to give all glory on and praises to Yahweh. Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Rahakodash, Dabon, City, Apostle Elsa, Great Millstone, Rule, Shalom, Wakasala, Bakia, Mawaflava, Bahasham.